Hello, it's me. Yes, Israel, the preaching lion. How are you today? Well, I'm coming today to say hello and tell you a little funny story that happened to me. The story is like this. Well, you know, you peoples, you take a, what's called a bath and you take a shower. Now, I don't know how you get that waterfall inside the house to come off your wall, but you do it somehow. I seen it one time watching through a window. Somebody was taking what you guys call a shower and you had this big waterfall coming inside the house. But it didn't get the whole house wet, but you got to take a bath all at one time. Well, we do too. Us kitties, even though I'm a big lion, we take baths too. Oh, look at that, a plane. Can you hear it? Going over right now, because I'm outside. Well, see, we take our bath outside. You take your bath inside. And we have to take our little tiny tongue and clean our whole body. But we love our whole body, so we're going to clean our whole body evenly, all the whole body, just like you do. You don't leave anybody out, any part of your body out. No, you clean the whole body. So after I clean my paws and my face, because you see you have to lick your paws to get your face clean. That's how we do that. And then I was cleaning my tail. Oh, I love my tail. I was cleaning my tail, but I love my tail, my body. I love my whole body the same way, wouldn't I? I mean, it's my body. So anyways, one day when I was cleaning my tail, can you believe it? My back feet, just because I hadn't gotten to them yet, got jealous. They got jealous, if that's the most silliest thing I ever heard. They were jealous of my tail. I'm like, oh, look at my feet, I go, feet, how could you be jealous? You're still part of the body now. Get the point. Do you know what I'm talking about today, folks? I'm talking about this. I'm talking about the body of Christ. We are all the same, and not one is better than the other. That's what Jesus said. He said he has no respect for persons. We're all the same. We're all the same team. We're all one body. So why are there people in the body getting jealous of other people? We all have our talents. My tail, well, it really doesn't do anything but sit there and look beautiful. Well, I guess it gives me some balance and swats off a few flies and stuff. But my feet do the walking. My paws help me with my face. My eyes let me see. My nose lets me smell. My tongue lets me taste and, and lick my fur, and my teeth let me eat, and my ears let me hear. We all have our own talents, so get over it. Don't be jealous. That's ridiculous. Just as it was ridiculous for my feet to be jealous of my tail. Isn't that ridiculous? <laughs> okay, well, think about it. We are all one body in Christ. We each have our talent. It's ridiculous to get jealous. Now, you people wouldn't get jealous, would you? feet get jealous of your hands? Would your ears get jealous of your mouth? And other parts of your body, would they be jealous of your other parts? Would your hair be jealous of your eyes? <laughs> that would be so funny. Can you imagine your hair going, how dare you look, look at those eyes all nice and everything. Or how about your eyes getting jealous? Oh, I never get the attention that you do, Mr. Hare, because you get brushed and I don't. See, isn't that ridiculous? And I know you're laughing right now. You should be. It's just that ridiculous. Why do you get jealous in the body of Christ? We need to love everybody and accept everybody. Everybody has their talent and there is no respecter of persons. Okay? So love all your body, your brothers and sisters in Christ. Don't be jealous. That's silly, okay? And you have a wonderful day. Remember, Jesus loves you, and that's why he died for us on the cross. He loves everybody. Have a great day. Remember, I'm Israel, and I'm here to, to serve you and to bless you. Have a bless. No, I can't bless you. I'm being silly, but God can bless you, and he loves all of us the same. Just remember that, okay? Bye-bye, and have a great day.